Hi, we're going to give an overview of the Big Blue Button Activity Module for Moodle 1.9 from Blindsight Networks. We'll start first by installing the module. To install it, we just go to the root level of the Moodle folder and unzip the activity module. It'll automatically install in the right directories. To finish installation, we'll log into the Moodle site as the administrator. Once logged in, we'll click the notifications link and that will trigger Moodle to detect the new module and set up the database tables and give us the option to provide the settings. There are only two settings needed. One is the URL for the BigBlueButton server. You typically have a separate server from the Moodle site. Here the default is a test install server that's provided by Blindside Networks. The security salt allows the activity module to make secure connections to the Moodle server or the BigBlueButton server. Here we're going to uh, again use a default. Once it's set up, uh, it's now ready to use. So let's show an example of how it could be used. We have a class, CS101, and we're going to turn on the editing. You'll see there's a new entry for an activity. We're going to add a big blue button link. We'll give it a name. We'll call it virtual class. And the other option is that we can make it so students must wait before a teacher joins. And this is good because it makes it easier, instead of having to schedule it, the students can't simply join the online class until a teacher has joined. Let's see how that works. We're going to open up another browser and in that other browser we're going to log into the class as a student. So a student's already been set up. Again this is a test site but we set up a student, Craig Greens, logs in, he's already enrolled in the class and let's say it's time for the online class to begin and you can see that the activity module says the class has not yet started yet waiting for a moderator. So we're going to start the class. Here we're logged in as administrator. The teacher could do it as well. The class starts up and in the students view there you can see that uh, their browser automatically detected. The class has started and you can see there are now two people in the online class. We'll do a quick overview of Big Blue Button, just some of the main features. Uh, we're going to upload a presentation. There's other videos that will show you all the features as a presenter. We'll give a quick chat message and you can see that it's appeared here in the students window. Um, we can log in uh, through the voice conference bridge. So now we're broadcasting the audio over the class. Students can log in as well or join the voice conference bridge and listen. The slide presentation we've uploaded has been finished converting. So you can see a bit of how it can be um, viewed remotely. Big Blue Button keeps the remote view in sync with the presenter. What the presenter sees is what the students see. So you can see the red dot moving around and pointing so the presenter can point. And we also have a built-in whiteboard. So you can highlight particular areas and then the highlighting is actually mirrored on the remote side as well. So they're now in sync. The last bit is we can look at the activity module and you can see it will show what current classes are active. Here the online class is available and there are two students in it. We can end it and this will end the class and this terminates it for both the teachers and the students. You can see here the administrator has been kicked out. And then there's no more users in the class. Very simple, very easy to use. So that's an overview of the activity module for Moodle 1.9 from Blindside Networks. We're the company that started the Big Blue Button project and we help you deploy Big Blue Button through integration, second level support, scaling, branding, hosting, and custom features. For more information, visit our website at blindsidenetworks.com.